All right, Daniel from from where? Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Hometown. Where in Pennsylvania? Pittsburgh originally. Okay. When did you move to Japan? Um, now, only like eight months ago. Okay. I fear. What was like jaw dropping for one moment? Or nothing really. Okay. Yeah, it's a lot of my first experience is twelve years ago coming here with band, punk band and touring. So I've been doing that ever since. So I've already seen like the wild, depraved, crazy side, and which was great. So which 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 is crazier, the wild punk scene in Japan or in Pennsylvania? Uh, Japan, they like to party a little more. It depends okay. city by city, but. Okay. Got really tired, lost a lot of weight from not sleeping, and sitting in a basement festering all day selling beer, basically, rotting away. Uh, a lot of friends, obviously, the band man friends, fun, it's just fun to see everybody and hang out all the time. But why, Kyoto, why living in Kyoto instead of Fukuoka or someplace? Uh, family. Okay. So what what do you think about Kyoto? Uh, I dig it. It's more like Midwest style. People are kind of inviting and natural after you get past the initial, you know, cold face. Okay. But with the music scene, it's not like that at all. But usual Kyoto style, you know, kind of cold at first, and then they open up, and it's like your family for life. Talk about a spike in your learning curve. Mm. Uh, puked and woke up face down in many of uh, squat toilets before, but that was band stuff. Um, saw a really good experience in Osaka one time. Uh, a guy at a live show walked up in the club, there was a Xerox copy machine, walked up to it, looked around, was totally wasted but pulled it off well, opened it up, just barfed into the machine, hit copy and just like casually walked away. And I just watched the whole thing in slow motion. Like, all right, I have something to live up to now.